Welcome guys to yet another episode of uh, How to DJ with Tractor and this is your host DJ Sandy. Today is the day where I am really excited. We are going to do our first mix. We are going to do our first mixing of the song where we mix two songs and uh, this is that moment you know that every DJ wants to do it and when everything is in uh, sync like the beats the phase, the tempo, uh, the key, everything is in sync. Uh, it sounds really, really good. So we'll get into harmonic mixing later on, but this tutorial is not harmonic mixing. This tutorial is how to beat match in Tractor. It's simple. Uh, manual beat matching is a little bit different. So let's, let's just get into it. Um, so in order to do uh, mixing you need two songs so for example um, I have loaded this song from Vishwatma which is Sat Samundar Par very good song uh, let's play it so for example this is a song uh, you know you're playing and then okay so for example at the end of this phrase uh, you want to bring in the next song so in order to do that uh, you can do beat matching and then mix in the next song at the end of this phrase so it doesn't sound weird it is a smooth transition so let's see this is the fourth cue point after which we have to bring in so what i'm going to do is i'm going to keep the cross fade on the left hand side so that we are not hearing anything on the right hand side all right so all right now let's find a point in song b where we want the song to come in all right so this this looks like a good place where the verse starts all right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take like four or maybe eight bars before that all right this uh, this this one uh, yeah this has a pretty steady beat which we can use to beat match all right to make beat matching easy what we can do is like create a cue point from where the song will will come in so what i'm going to do is like create a cue point over here all right so let's do this so for example the song is playing and at the end of this phrase we want to bring in the next song so beat match basically so all right right over here somewhere all right i'm just going to forward again what you have to do is first the second song which you are bringing in you have to make sure they are in the same speed they are in the same speed uh, they have the same bpm bpm is beats per minute so in tractor if you see over here this song is 130 beats per minute 130 bpm so the next song which i have taken it's it's also 130 bpm so the, the speed match now it's just that we have to start them at the same time i'm like you know uh, so that the beats are in sync so let's do this um, we are going to do it the automated way first all right so where tractor is going to do the beat matching for us and uh, for that let's see how it is you just have to press the play button when you want to so let's see all right so i press the play button and now the two songs are in are in sync they're playing at the same time but they're they're out of phase over here. This is the phase meter. So you can just pitch band. Alright. So these two songs they are in uh, sync right now. So if I just move this fader from here to here, it will start. Can slowly cut this song cool all right so that's manual beat matching 
I can do the same thing. Using sync. So for example, I forgot to hit the sync. So now, if you hit the sync, it's automated. Just wait for it. Now you see, we didn't have to do anything with the phasing. Tractor automatically synced it. Now take the base out from here. Now you can you can hear the song in the background. That's it. Perfect. And that's it. You can bring in the next song, and you can use sing or you can do manual beat mashing as we did earlier and that's your first mix guys hope hopefully you enjoyed this mix uh, any questions do let me know any part you didn't understand let me know and i'll try my best to help you out okay thanks so much